but it's a sense I'm coming for the education system. <laughs> I want to be able exactly. to have, I want to find this type of, you know, rigorous peer reviewed academic research that shows that um, our guts are right in the sense that um, autonomy does matter. Right. And, right. and that, that, that and evidence is already there. Read the yeah. footnotes in the book. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's, <laughs> we, we've got and, the proof. We've just got to bring it out there, yeah. Right. Yeah. And, and so what I've discovered is that, that the, the challenge is, is not the people in the system. It is the system itself. It's that there's, it's built on assumptions and organizational forms that contradict what we've discovered about autonomy. Mm -hmm. Um, I call it superstition. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it, it, you can it's use that term. Superstition. It's no different to the to the way that religion used to world run the world in a sense. Right, and 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 uh, so yeah. my training in psychology is, uh, you know, I I have a behavioral background. Um, mm. My and, and so superstition in that sense is is about so when when you're training a pigeon um, to press a lever. And if you accidentally get it to turn left every time before it presses the lever, the, the left turn is a superstition. It's yeah. an extraneous behavior that, that occurs and reoccurs. Mm -hmm. And in fact, the, the, the bird self-reinforces that before it gets the true reinforcement of the, the, the pellet from the lever press. Mm -hmm. um, and, and so superstition in both, in, in a sense of just, there's something unnecessary, and maybe in, in the case of, of, of the way it, schools are currently working in the mainstream, is counterproductive to mm -hmm. what's truly educative. And th this is the, the focus of my new book, is to be more precise and clear about what that means, what I mean by uh, there, there's something counterproductive in the way things are organized. Mm -hmm. so, so thinking about Rafe Esquith, and, and you know, he actually, eventually uh, was was drummed out of the system as happens to all, every teacher that i know of that has had a movie made about them or had a truly best-selling book has been essentially rejected by the system this is the agentic schools podcast where you will learn about schools from around the world where children's agency to make decisions about their learning and living is more important than their academic skills I'm your host, Don Berg.